Hello, my name is Amy Sturkey. I am a pediatric physical therapist and I have about a little over 30 years clinical experience and I'm working on a series of activities to do with children who are low tone. And my co-instructor is almost four years old. Her name is Myla. And in this video, we are walking on uh, a surface. So this surface is about six or seven inches wide. And um, I, uh, again, I'm gonna demonstrate first, trying to make it look like so much fun that everyone watching this wants to do it right after me. So uh, let's watch me do it. Ready? I'm gonna go on, 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 on. Da -da 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 -da. I'm gonna go on, 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 on. Uh, You'll notice in this video that I again did a sing-songy on, on, on. Um, I find that if I add that little sing-songy touch that it works best. I also did a little celebration once I got to the end so that they knew that the, the child knew that there was an end goal of making it all the way across. Um, and now it's Myla's turn, so let's see how she does. Yeah. Hey, okay, walk go. on it. Walk on it. No, walk on it, Myla. On, 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 uh-oh, oh, on, stay on, 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 yay! yay! Again? Go again, walk on it. On, 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 yay! So this time uh, they helped Myla do this with one hand held, walking across, and uh, Milo really understood this concept of staying on as opposed to on and off in the previous video. Um, so uh, I think after watching that, I decided, well, she can go a step harder. Let's see what she does if she does it all by herself. Walk on it. On, 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 on. Yay! So Mila rocked that. She did go fast, so it's easier to stay on something if you're going fast, but she went across without stepping off. It was perfect. Um, if I was, when, when I'm in the clinic, I have different boards. I have a board that's 10 inches wide. I have a board that's seven inches wide. I have a board that's four inches wide. And here we were using um, a rolled up blanket. So um, it, it, it it's a little harder to make that smaller than what it is now. But if you go to boards, you can make it smaller. And um, if sometimes boards are thicker, so they can be a little bit more elevated. And that can sometimes encourage people to stay on a little bit better. Um, but those are all just gen general ideas how to work on narrowing up your base of support and encouraging dynamic balance development. I hope this is helpful for you. And I'll look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks a lot. Bye bye. If you liked this video and would like to be notified by email when the next video comes out, click the subscribe button here and click the golden bell icon and ensure notifications are enabled on your account.